I have an iPhone storage tip for you guys today. Uh, you may be running into a certain situation in which you are out of storage on your iPhone and your storage might be actually being taken up by apps that you currently don't have downloaded. So for example, you see a bunch of different apps here with the iCloud icon and I don't actually have those apps downloaded on my phone. However, some of these apps might be taking up a significant amount of space in my storage. So let me go ahead and show you how you can check to see if this is happening and then how to uh, make sure that you get rid of that data. So we wanna first go into settings. And then once we're inside our settings, we wanna go ahead and tap on where it says general. Then when we're in our general settings here, we can go ahead and select iPhone. And it's gonna calculate our storage. And now if we scroll down to the bottom, we will see all of our apps. And those apps are going to be ordered from the largest size to the smallest size. So we can see like my photos here has 172 gigabytes worth of data on it. However, we can see right here, CapCut has 6.44 gigabytes worth of data and yet I do not have CapCut downloaded on this phone right now. You can see the iCloud, iCloud icon right here. So what we wanna do is tap on this, and if we wanna get rid of that data, we can go to Delete App, okay? So it's kind of not intuitive because it's, it's asking us if we want to reinstall the app, which implies that we don't have it, and yet it also asks us if we want to delete it. And the reason for this is because it's still holding the information, right, that we previously had. It's still holding that 6.44 gigabytes worth of information, worth of data. So if I tap on delete, now I can go ahead and delete this app, and it's going to delete all of the data along with it. You can see right here it says we'll also delete all of the documents and data. So this is where you want to go ahead and delete that app. And it'll take a few moments for it to delete, but... Now you'll see that it's not showing up on my list and I will now have you know six gigabytes worth of data more. So this is something that you wanna check on because you might have deleted an app and that app is still holding storage on your iPhone. So uh, just wanted to give you this quick tip. If it helped you out, I'll see you next time.